audio will peak right at the beginning, and I'll be like, what happened? Ah! <laughs> I'll hear it. I, I tried to make it sound like when, you know, we ended on the last one. Oh. And it comes back in with me. That was a long time ago. I can't remember that far. <laughs> that was a long time ago. Centuries ago. Ah, fuck, I have scope spray. Well, I'm playing like balls. I apologize, people. Balls. My fucking balls. Balls. Poor fucking ball. I miss. I forgot to pick up the damn map. I realized that. I was thinking, like, I was thinking there was one. I was like, there's a map around here, isn't there? What am uh, I looking at? Yep, yeah, there is, but you can't go back now. Sure I can. Ah, well, but you can go back now. I just gotta figure out where the hell I am. I got bullets. Bullets? More. I got rifle. shells. Like, like, from the beach. <laughs> <laughs> That's what... It's like my granny got me. If you put your ear to, up to it, it makes a sound. It goes. These just go boom, but. It goes, what's up? <laughs> and so when you talk into it, you can hear yourself echo. Granny! Granny! What's up? Granny! That's so funny. Frick. That's okay, you just. There's no big deal, it's not like you, okay. it's not like you lost, you don't know what you're talking about. Pulled into another dimension. Yeah. I'm back here again. More bathroom. Oh, this has got to be the same one. Okay. What's in here? Rule number three, oh, beware of bathrooms. That from? Uh, I watched Zombie Land the other day, or yesterday. Yesterday, I think it was yesterday. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, that knocks. Hello. <laughs> You're taking a jokey. Let's see. Yeah. The only like, like the really charming thing about this game is that, like. It was in a time where like graphics weren't so great, so you can actually kind of play around with them, and make it even look even creepier. Well, that's why I like the HD version of this game doesn't work. Like, yeah, it's too clean. Okay, and then the next room has the uh, first aid. Yeah, the graphics in this make it look dirty and grimy. Doity. It looks doity and grimy. Blimey. <laughs> blimey, grimy. It looks a bit blimey. I mean, grow, I mean. It'd be cool if, like, if there's like a shadow there. It'd be a bit scary. Oh, yeah, that'd be tight. Especially because, like, well, like, the way the camera is, you'd be looking through it. Yeah. Because a part like hitting your head. But this game's not even just scary, it's also just creepy. Creepy and scary. It's spoopy. Spoopy. Spoopal. Don't worry, Peter. That's why they call it Spoopal. <laughs> hey, Peter. <laughs> hey, Peter. This is how you talk like Joe. Patrick Warburg. Oh, he sounds pretty serious. Oh, Lord. Oh. The thirst is real. Is that right, fellas? <laughs> the thirst is real. Oh, here's the map. Hooray. Thanks, Jeebus. Johannes McGinnis. You can't go in those doors that are scribbled. Yep. 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 Shit, you guys. See you later. Those doors that are scribbled. They're all squibbled out. Oh, oh shit, you guys. That is way too close. Wow. Like, I'm way too close. I'm, I'm way too close to the top of the screen. We loads a weapon. Oh, that's a terrifying sound. Tablet of the seductress. Did you hear that? Yeah. What was that? I think it was uh, another one of those crawling things. One of those ghosties? Yes. Oh, shit! Oh, 
Oh fuck, it's a ghosty. Good time. There you go, my guy, I got you. Hey, hey, huh? I know it's a Cody. It's the wandering Cody. Do it. Hey, That's when you shoot me. <laughs> what's up, what's up, what's up? Yo, what's up? James, yo, what's up? This is a good angle. Yo, what's up? Damn it. Maybe the, the James goes. Yeah. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, what'd you think of that Resident Evil 7 trailer? Speaking of spooky things. Uh, I don't really know. It was, there was not a lot there. I mean. It was weird, wasn't it? It was really weird. Like, it looked like it tried to portray, like, a new story, but, like, not a new story? I don't really know. It didn't really, like, feel like Resident Evil. It looked more like a horror movie that they do today, like creepy, silent figures crawling, you know, sweeping past the doorway, and then you go out there, and then it's not down the hallway, you turn around, and there it is! Like, like I looked on Reddit about it, and uh, apparently there was like a press conference like afterwards with like everybody, and Cap the guys at Capcom were like... Yeah, it's a sequel to Six. I mean, it's like, it's in the timeline. Like, uh, what the fuck does it have to do with anything? Like, yeah. I guess we'll find out. I mean, Chris, this way, like, all of a sudden, like, Wesker kicks the door. Yeah. Harry Burton's like, whoa, 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 stop. 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 That's how your controller goes on the fridge right there. It's a piece of poop. Yeah, you need to get you some new controllers. Well, I bought a whole new fucking console and it didn't work, so... Yeah. Well, it did work, but, you know, I was like... I, I did that, I breathed kind of loud, and I was like, I think that's sensitive. Yeah. <laughs> wandered away. And then my mom got mad at me. Um, but yeah, it's a sequel to 6. Like, huh. I never played 6. I, I it was played awful. 5, so... Uh, 5 was... Not great. It was okay. Oh, there's a fucking cafeteria I was looking for. No, uh, it's like I was. I thought it was. I thought it hit its peak at four. It hit its peak. And I didn't even like four. That I mean, till I played it, and it was fun. It, I mean, it didn't really feel like a Resident Evil game. See, yeah, that's what. Like, when 4 first came out, like, me and my, uh, he probably won't mind if I name call him, me and my buddy Jared, like, we grew up, well, we shouldn't have grown up playing them, but we played, we played 1 through 3, yeah, like, tirelessly, like, together, by ourselves, whatever. Then I bought 4, and he played it, and he's just like, and that's what he, like, I'll never forget that, like, when it came out, he's like, yeah, it's just not, it's not really It's evil. fun, it's... I enjoy playing it, it's just, it's not the same. Yeah. And, you know, people are, a lot of people were complaining about uh, this new game, like the same way, saying, you know, it's not the same. Yeah. But, I mean, I mean, you can only rehash the same idea so many times, though. That's I true, guess. too. I don't know, this game, though. Set, I mean, I'll play it. Because it's, it's just one of those series I have to check it out. But. Yeah, I mean maybe maybe they, you know, do it well on this next one. What in this pig? Cause, I mean it's just it's like the movies they just kind of got. Oh, they were terrible. I hated them. Uh, like I liked I liked up to like the third, maybe the fourth one, but not really even the fourth one. Like I like one, two, and three. Like I thought the first, like I thought the first one was okay. I thought the second one was pretty good. I liked, I liked the second one because it, it it made me feel like I was playing Resident Evil Two. Oh fuck! Like the whole time I was like, this is Resident Evil Two. Well, like I thought that part was cool of it, but then they're like, but look how cool fucking Alice is, and let's make it about like. Yeah, it's like Joe Valentine's like poop. Right. Compared. 
She even says it. She says, I'm good, but I'm not that good. Really? You had to have her say that? Jill Valentine's the shit. And, like, why does Jill even exist in the universe? Because... Yeah. It's not like there was, like... There's a horseshoe there? I just... Where's the horseshoe at? It's supposed to be a horseshoe. Where is it? Um... It's like... I'll go back to the door. Okay. Um... But, like, why is that Jill good? Because was there an R-Clay? Was there a problem at R-Clay? Like, there was in the game? Or what? Yeah. Because R-Clay's never mentioned. I'm pretty... I'm, I, like, I think that... It takes... On, like... Because she already knows what they are, basically. So I'm thinking it's, like, all the shit that happened right after... The mansion in the first game. For Jill Valentine. Cause I think that would be a good movie. Like, if you're going to do, like, Andrew's Resident Evil movie. <laughs> There's a lot of do-its. There's a lot of do-its. Yeah. Alice is like, do it. And she shoots Nemesis, and Nemesis was like, do it. She's like, do it, do it. <laughs> Yo, daughter. I forgot where to go, sorry for being Yeah. So we're just kind of standing here for a second. So, so fun. Look at my goal! Just doing some excerpts from the Code of Clones for the fan. When it says use fire, you gotta use fire! It does that. When you fight Magus. <laughs> Do it, oh yeah. Fog, woman, and walk tackle. Fire does damage when he uses fire. Then don't, don't use any other because they won't. That's why Megus is such a pain in my balls. But it's cool, because it gets to be a character later, which is probably why that game's the best in the world. World. It is. That's one of the reasons why I really like this, because, you know, Megus, like, come, turns out to not be such a bad guy. Kind of like an anti-hero kind of thing. The dirty hero. Dirty hero? The joity hero. Does not take a bath like Megas, take a bath. You're a dirty hero. His his mom is Queen Sh Queen Zeal. Yeah. His mom got mad at him. <laughs> Cause he was like, I want five white strawberry wavoses <laughs> on a tray. This is scary hallway. I don't like it. Cause this is whispering dudes. <laughs> hey. You want some candy? Hey, come over here and get in my van. Oh my god! Like, hey, I got all kinds of toys back here. Fuck. That's what he's. That's what they're all whispering. All kinds of toys. Yeah. I have toys and doodads. I got free Wi-Fi. James, is, James is like, okay, and then he gets tied up. Like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> toys and doodads. And it's time to stop this episode with that. So next time. Do it.